Hello, welcome back to the Flying Rebel Alliance symbol here on Starship Theory. Today's plan, we gotta first we have to recover from what our, our last mission. We are like super damaged by what? 36 hull. So uh yeah, for the first part of this, we're gonna be working about uh repairing some things. We um I need to turn these things on. You go down here, you go up there. Like that, and your tasks are going to be over here. So, yeah, for the most part, we're going to be sitting over here just repairing things. We have lots and lots of damaged things, so we'll let them do that for a bit. We'll let Hong stick on general so he can get some things cleaned up, but everyone else will engineer and fix this stuff. Notice, Roderick over here is eating red food because we have red plants. <laughs> I just, I never noticed that before. So, there's been a lot of comments about my lack of weaponry and armor on my ship. I don't know why you need those kind of things on a spaceship, but I suppose we should probably start thinking about. Maybe a bit of armor. Right now we have a zero armor and zero shields. Uh, and the only weapons we have are these two terrible lasers. Uh, we do have weapons four right now. So we could get the chain gun. Um, however, I was looking at this earlier. And the plasma turret is reload time two seconds versus reload time five seconds. This fires five shots of one versus one shot of four. So that's like eight and a half damage in the time that this one does five. And it does use a little more heat, though. But I think the plasma turret's going to be the better way of doing it. So what, we'll worry about the... We'll do plasma turret. That's what I'm trying to say here. Uh, but as soon as we get that, we need to start thinking about defenses. And by defenses, I mean, we don't have to have, like, um, anything massive to begin with. But just some simple armor plating provides 20 units of armor for us. And with that, plus the armor repair, we can, pop, we can maybe, maybe survive a fight. Right now, we're just a, uh, a lumbering hulk of a ship that's sort of floating through space that's... That's mostly cracked at the moment. Um, yeah, that's going to be our mostly our main priority. We, we can probably get this all taken care of this episode. I want to get the ship done this episode. That's my that's first priority. Second priority, weapons. Third priority, defenses. That sounds like a plan. So what we need to do is get this done. We'll move someone over here to science. We can probably do that. Do we want to do that now? There's so Look at all this. There's so much to get repaired. The ship is so big, we need more people. Put that priority in there somewhere, too. We need more people. Um... I've been making beds that people aren't using, which probably is a bad idea, I suppose. Uh, we don't have a captain, so we'll make that a general bed. So, yeah, and then folks can actually have some beds. Now, down here, um, we have the engine, which is really doing nothing for us. Um, we're going to leave the engine in just because it looks right, having an engine. We might put another one in there. I don't know that that's what we want to do. Like, do we want to focus on being an evasion ship? No, it's never going to happen. But we could... Just worry about armor plates and be a tank. A tank of a ship, I think, is going to be what we're going to have to do. Just because we're so big. I don't know how... I mean, I guess you could cram things in. We made it like this because it looked cooler, having um, proper bedrooms. I mean, we could we could just line them all up. They don't even have to be in separate bedrooms. So we could have made it a lot smaller. I and mean, we have all kinds of extra space over here. But it looks cool, and that's the important part. Uh, anyways, let's we'll let them continue working here. Let's go ahead and... Let's go ahead and call into a ship, actually. If they're angry, we can... Ooh, we can't jump. Hopefully they won't be angry. <laughs> uh, I'm hoping we can sell some things. We have water, we have silicon, we have a little bit of gold. I'm hoping we can sell some things and we can buy a crewman. Oh, we can. Sell 48 water. And now we have enough to buy a crewman. Excellent, yes. Who do we get? Uh, where's my people? We got... Franklin. Hey, it's Franklin. Alright. Good. Franklin, you are... Well, you have a little bit of, si of intelligence. That ain't bad. Franklin, you are now a science man. Well, I sh if anyone's going to be a science man, Earl should be science first. So, Earl, go science. Um, yeah, Earl, and I'm going to let Franklin science also. That way... What? What was that? What, what just broke? I don't know what that was, but something broke. And I, don't know that, that, I don't know what that was. Uh, all right, whatever. Uh, I need to look at the ship to see if I should threaten it. No, we probably shouldn't be threatening anything. Um, so with the two of them getting science, you know what we could do, actually? We could just put two science stations in here. That would really crank out the science. I'll give you an asteroid field coming in. Let's see if we can get some metals. Uh, most of the repairs are done. I'm going to go ahead and set up this, so if we get done with those repairs fast enough, they'll come up here and they'll start working on these. So we will have a bridge. We're going to put in our operations consoles up here with some chairs, maybe a captain's seat back behind them. We have some things over here on the sides as well. And then we're going to move all the science stuff over here. So the research station will come over this way. We will move the navigation console up here. 
and go over here, maybe a bed over this way. We can put a bed there too. Yeah, I guess that's an idea. Uh, I was also looking at this for defenses. We can build these armor plates, which are kind of tiny. We can also eventually get the large ones though, and that's what we could put right in here. These large plates, which I think would work out pretty well there. Um, all right, time to, uh, whoops, oops, wrong button. Time to mine some things. Let's hope we get a lot of metals here. I have plans of building things today. Because we're going to need lots of metals for all the guns we plan on making. And I'm hoping we get it this time. Really, I'm hoping to get it this time because you stop yelling at me. You commenters. <laughs> yeah, give me water. There we go. I need a giant red one. Please. I don't need any more water. There we go. I'll take gold. Um, I don't see any red ones. Red? Oh, I need some metals, please. Metals, please. We're at 105, which actually isn't too bad, but we're going to be using it to get those floors done. Plus, these guns take like... The plasma charts take 40 metal. No, I don't know what they take, actually. 40 energy. Not 40 metal. Ah. Did I really get, like, zero medals out of that? I got zero medals out of that asteroid field. That's terrible. Somebody's coming in to say hello. Let's see what we get. Oops. Um, I hope they're not aggressive. We can't jump, and we're going into a sun. So we're going to have some fires to be putting out. Can you get here already so I can... Decide what I want to do with you. Um, power is a is kind of on the edge. Was that a reactor over there that went? Put that back. I think what I want to do. I think I do want to remove these and put reactors back here, like a line of reactors there. And uh, yeah, just a few reactors there. Maybe some up here. Where'd that ship go? Oh well. I'm going to... Little metals we have. Let's go ahead and send them a course for an asteroid field. We need to buy some... Or mine some metal. Hopefully we get metals out of this asteroid field this time. Um, let's go ahead and move. Operations, I'm going to move my navigation console here. Feels like it should be in the front. Like that. We'll put a chair on it as well. So then this will get removed and put up there. We're at level 6 weapons. Which means we're going to buy ourselves a plasma turret. And it's going to go, uh, look at it. What does it take to build? 40 metals, 30 silicon, 20 gold. Okay, we can only build one right now, but well, that's fine. Actually, what can we do? No, we can only do one because of the metals we're missing. But it's going to be cool. And asteroid field is here. Good. Give me some metals. As soon as it gets done, we're going to start shooting with it. We may not have the power for it. In fact, I know we don't have the power for it. Uh, while we're doing this uh, engine, this uh, mining, let's go ahead and place. We have that one there. We're at 240. Yeah, let's do another one. Um, in fact, I'm going to give them the job of removing these. Uh, not that. I'm going to floor that. Don't remove. Don't remove. You know what? That reminds me. If I put a hole in my ship or if something put something else puts a hole in the ship, I will die. Because we don't have life support yet. Maybe we should worry about that. Um, yeah, maybe we should. Because right now we don't have any oxygen. And if we put a hole in the ship, we're going to lose all our oxygen. And that would be bad. That would be the end of us. <laughs> I don't want I don't want to end like that. So maybe oxygen is going to be kind of important. I guess, being on a ship. Here we go. You out. That was one metal in that. Let's fire the plasma gun. I don't have the, I don't have the power for it. Um, turn off 
the laser turrets. Plasma turret. On. Plasma turret, you're going to be control three. Now, let's see what you can do, buddy. Shoot that asteroid. Ooh. Ooh. Sounds and looks cool. And that's what really matters. Oh, very nice. Oh, uh, give me that. Give me that. Give me, give me, give me. And then we got a little bit of it. Take you. I really need some nice metal chunks. There's one going the wrong way. Man, there's such a lack of metal here. Hmm. Well, it gave us a little bit. Uh, let's set course for another one. That's right, I feel. Okay, he's gonna be on that. You know... Maybe we should build another science station. Oh, what's, what's Alyssa doing over here? Alyssa. Working engines. Oh, look at that. Cruise... Oh, it's actually better. Because she's working it, she has a skill of two in engineering, which is giving me a boost. Right? Normally it's minus two. Normally it should be no minus normally I should be minus twenty-three on it. But because she's working it, it's minus twenty-two. Maybe we can have some actually nice engines. We have people working it. Uh, I can buy a crewman for five hundred, which I don't have. I can sell you ten for hundred and ninety-two, which is a good idea. And I can threaten you. What are those? You have two guns. Could we fire at them? We can almost jump. We'll be able to jump by the time this Starts. Do we threaten them? I think we certainly should. Who needs armor plates? Uh, can I turn these on? I don't have the power for that, but I can turn off the la mining lasers, and then I'll have enough. Uh, we can remove this this console over here. We're going to fire at... I don't know what gun that is. I'm a little worried that I don't know what gun it is. Oh, there we go. It's a rocket. Oh, it's a rocket pod. How, da how damaging are you? Reload time, seven seconds. No big deal. We got this. Okay, we are going to... We're going to threaten them. Oh, we did it. We did it. Excellent. That's right. Yeah. We're like a space bully. <laughs> Thanks for the cash. The, the, so the, the possibilities of this game, this is I think what makes me so, so excited about this game, is I've always wanted a game where you could like command a crew, I've always been this big Star Trek nerd, and so you could like command a crew and you can you can build your, you know, have your ship and, and go on missions or whatever, and something, it's a game I've always wanted, and imagine like, I hope they really develop this game out, because if, get, if it gets to the point where we could, uh, like maybe we can build a ship to be a bounty hunter, and we have some sort of a, I don't know how you would do it, like if you have to build some sort of star system and have missions and things like that, or maybe we just want to make a some sort of cargo hauler and all we do is just transfer metals around, or metal transfer cargo around, maybe illegal materials or whatever, and, and play more of like a simulation style game. I don't know. Uh, and the possibilities are endless. And I'm excited that we see where this game will go. But, yeah, I want a game where I can uh, captain the ship. I remember whenever Star Trek Online was was uh, first like announced. I thought it was going to be like a game where rather than having a raid, you would actually your group would command a ship. Like you would have one person would play as the the captain, one person would be the engineering guy, another person would be I don't know the science guy, and they would each like all work together on one ship. But it it came out ended up being just like a regular old boring MMO. Which I was kind of bummed about. My bed just got destroyed. You go like well, I can't because it's broken. But it, it ended up being lame. So still on the lookout for a proper Starship Simulator game. All right, uh, Earl, why aren't you sciencing? Why is this bro why is this burning and no one doing it? Hong, how about you take care of that fire, buddy? Oh, Franklin's got it. All right, we want to remove these. I'm going to move that airlock to... Should I put one in the back of the ship and the front, or just one in the middle? 
We'll just stick one there. Someone get in the fire. Hang in the fire. Earl's got it. Okay, and we're gonna remove that. And then in here we're gonna place some reactors. How's our engineering? Oops. How's our research doing? We have our two utilities, so we'll come back to defenses. Let's buy the life support. I think we probably should place it. This is just, just going to produce air. Are you getting that fire? What are you... No. The fire, buddy. Okay. Um, can I access food? Is my food thing off? Did I, my food... No, it's right there. Food is better. Turn on. Okay. Uh, life support. I'm going to stick it... Sure, right there is fine. Pumps oxygen. Yeah, there we go. So if we do get a hole in the ship, maybe we won't, like, lose everything. <laughs> we probably should have built one of those a long time ago, too. You know, priorities. Beds are more important. That bre <laughs> Beds that we don't use, we end up sleeping on the floor anyways. <laughs> we still have three operations. I don't know that I need any of these just yet. Armor console might be nice to have, though. Proves armor recharge. If we get some armor things. Which we will get at... I think we just go for the plates. Medium plate. Oh, those are long. This is worth 50 and this is worth 20. So these are actually better. Stick some plates on there. Yeah, we'll do that. Uh, let's head for a... Are you not on? These are done now. Let's put a floor there. I'm going to remove the captain's chair because it's going to get moved. And we're going to put in some small reactors. I can probably just line them up, right? Put three of them here. Here we go. We put three there and three there. That would work. These are each giving us how much? Each giving us 60 units of power. We build a medium one. They're a lot bigger, but it provides 250 units. We could eventually remove those, I guess, in that. And a large one. How much does that provide? 550 units of power. Just with one unit. Ooh, we need that. But that's going to be down the list on the priorities. We need defenses and, and weapons. Okay, get those done. Uh, it just kind of seems like these research consoles, maybe they should be up here. I don't know. I guess we can put them in here. Chairs right there. I do want more than one, though. So I want to get some research done. Put one there. Actually, let's go ahead and just put both of them over here. Right there, and we can put our chairs there and there. Storage is looking okay. We don't need any more storage things. Um, I I can't buy a crewman. I would really like to. I could threaten you and get fifty gold. It's not really worth it. I'm very close, but not quite. They have... These are terrible. These are nice. But my one... I don't think we could do it without any sort of armor. I mean, we could try. We can jump if we get in trouble, right? Yeah. We can jump if we get in trouble. What's the harm? Um, let's go into a blue alert and a red alert. Nothing to worry about here. We just go into low alerts. We just do that. Make sure I don't ever hit the black button. Um, you know, this happens from time to time. What's going on? Oh, fires. Oh, they're leaving. Can I threaten them? They're leaving now. If I threaten them, they're now hostile. Okay. I, I don't have the... I don't have the CPU for the plasma turret. Okay, turn my only lasers off. Plasma turret. Still can't be on. Um... Here's your station off. Why does it look like it's... Is it on? Why is it white? What does white mean? Why does white mean? Um, where's my regular weapons? Laser turrets are on, so we can fire those at... That. That's what I'm really worried about. Oh, they're leaving. All right. Well, it was worth a shot, I guess. Our threat failed. Well, 
I can't imagine why. We're a ship with no armor and no shields. <laughs> with a gun we can't seem to use for some reason. Turn on, turret. Uh, let's go ahead and get some... I have a CPU now. Why don't you work? Now you work. Hey. Okay. I don't know. There it goes. Okay. Okay. Um, well, we do need some CPU. So let's do that. I'm glad we didn't like get. I'm glad they didn't fight back. Because that could have been bad since we, you know, weren't prepared, weren't ready for it. CPU. I would really like to get a CPU core because that provides 200 units with one of those, and it's just a little box. Little barrel you stick in your in your ship somewhere, and that would be pretty handy. I need to turn off. Well, once we get these built, we'll be good. You can get on. You can be on. This one needs to get removed. Sorry, Earl. You get to go to a new one. What we need is more people. We get one more scientist in, we can have two researchers, one plant guy. And then we start, I don't know what uh, a military does. I don't know if he actually does anything yet. It could be something that's later on in the game, that's like uh, planned for later later in the game. Uh, I'm not sure. Okay, let's go through the asteroid field and see if we can get some metal. We're down to seven metals. Is coming up somewhere. Here it comes. Okay. I'm gonna move this over here. Earl's having a snack, some green stuff. Franklin, defense is one. Good. Uh, my lasers, are they off? Oops. Water's okay. I really need metals. Can you fire at this? How's the heat with that? Oh, it's off. Heat looks to be okay. Yep, heat's doing just fine. We'll see how it is whenever I start mining something along with it, but it uses, what, four, I think is what it was, per shot. Uh, we probably shouldn't do that, because it's going to start breaking things, and then things will start flying away or something. Uh, three, X. Don't hit! No. I really need some metal. There's one way over there to the right. go. Take that. And plenty of gold. Systems are overheating just barely, though. Do I have a heat vent off? Or I'm only one of them got destroyed. I think I thought I had five before. All the jobs are done. I should give engineers some jobs. Uh, defenses are at two. Does that give me anything? Hole braces. Increases structure buffer. Can walk over diagonal brace. Um, yeah, I'll try it because I'm not really sure what they do. I think... We set them in places like that. Let's just see what it does. You can walk over them diagonally, it says. Right? That's what it says. You can walk over a diagonal brace. I'm not really sure how to understand that. Let's just see what those two do. Uh, those two do. Um... I think everything else is good. Chairs are in there. We also have these things we can do hole markings. I don't really know how this works. Like, can I... I mean, what does it do? I can just, like, write letters or something. Put my captain's chair back in there. And we can't do much because we don't have the medals for it. But hopefully we'll find some. Yeah. Come on, medals. No 
metals. You need like, like five big metal asteroids. There's one that's moderate size metal asteroid. Take it. A little bit more. Hole braces and oh look at that our our uh, hole has gone up to 120 because of those braces. Well, we should make those too. Oh, I see metal metal coming. Hmm. Excellent. There's, look at that. Way, there's a lot of it way over to the right. It'd be nice to have. Thank you, and I'm going to go all on you. Heat is a little bit crazy. But we're all right. Nothing burned. And we just have X's there at the front of our ship. But we can change those. I'll show you here in a second. Come in. More metals. There we go. Much better. Still not a ton, but something. Luckily, our astronauts don't get hit by uh, by chunks of asteroids while they're out flying around. Otherwise, we have to go to like a, a blue alert every time we went to an asteroid belt. Now, are we ready to... We have the money, almost have the money to buy a person. Should we call another ship? I think we'll do that. And with that. Okay. This is much this is a bigger asteroid belt. And look at this with 120 structure. Come on, there we go. Uh, yeah, this is a kind of a big belt. Um, you shoot at that while we work on this one. Oop. More repairs. Okay, I think we made it through the belt. And I think... Oops. Uh, X is the button I'm looking for. X is the button I'm looking for. So yeah, so these. We can rename. We can put like a... I don't know. Uh, a. And then it changes to an A. We can only put one letter in there. We can put... I don't know. P. So it says P-A. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, so we can be the PP ship. I don't know. But, um, yeah. So I don't know what the point of that is. I guess it's just for lettering. We can do a bunch of them all across here, and so we can say like bridge. Uh, I guess is I guess is what the point of that is. Anyways, we've reached the end of the episode. Thanks again for watching, and I will see you next time. <laughs>